Hello, welcome to Dreamlight Valley. This is me. My name is Emily. Here's a little friend I just made. Um, I'm going to give him something to eat. These little sea turtles are so adorable. And the island has, or the my world has, this is my pet raccoon. He's fun to play with. He is my companion, so he follows me around wherever I go. And I'm down here on Dazzle Beach. You can fish. Yes, Goofy's here. And we're on the beach because um, I'm at my little vacation home. And I'm just starting to work on it. Today we bought a, um, a couch. And this game is totally like Animal Crossing on steroids. <laughs> I love this game enormously. This is my, let's see, fourth or fifth day playing. Oh, my inventory is full. Okay. The little raccoon goes out in the water. This is the beach. And everything is so cool. I'm going to grab some bananas. And these blueberries. And here's another little sea turtle. He's shy. Um, I have a couple of sea turtles that are already my friend. And when I run into them, they are so cute. They'll chase me around the island or down on the beach section. But anyway, as you can see, this game is really beautiful. This is the back of my house. Duck is here. This is his houseboat where he lives. My letters are good. Yes. yes. Model citizens. Let's go up to the main valley. You get to decorate everything. All of this stuff I put in. You can rearrange everything. This, you can move houses around. This is Goofy's house. This is the meadow. We have a little fishing pond here. I'm gonna grab some raspberries for the squirrels. We'll see if we can find some. The character from Encanto lives here. I, she just came today. I brought her in, but I had totally messed up her house where I put it. But I can move it. Um, this is another entrance down to the beach. And a very strange octopus lady. Her name's Ursula. She lives here. She was trapped in a cave, and when I got her out of the cave, it was a quest. Um, <clears throat> it was in this cave that she was trapped, so I thought I'd move her house and put it into, uh, well, where it is right now. So this was the cave where she was trapped, and it's really beautiful.
And the other house down here is for the Little Mermaid. This is her home. It's quite the setup. And the interior is really cute. Um, and this is, I've never, I don't know who this character is because I've never seen any of the films, but She's here, we'll bring her down. Well, no, I can't. My inventory is too overloaded. But she brings me fish all day or during different times of the day. And there's uh, Mr. Scrooge or Scrooge Donald Duck's uh, uncle. There's a pier over here. This bridge is blocked, so I can't go back uh, cut across to the other beach. But that's okay. Eventually, I'll be able to figure out how to get rid of that. You can purchase things at this little stand that Goofy runs. And let's see. Over in this direction, you can go up into the woods. And there are raccoons that you can make friends with, which this game is totally um, after my heart. Um, oh, here's Remy. I brought Remy. He's a new game character, and his restaurant is down by the plaza. You can come in and cook with him. This is the Encanto house, which where I put it, this is kind of a mistake. I blocked off the stairway to the frozen section, but the frozen section is blocked. Once I get that open, but the Encanto house is really cute. Makes noises, just like out of the movie. Let's see if any of the raccoons are out. But you can, um, you can mine for ore. Ooh, there went a raccoon. I have a couple of raccoons that are my friends, I'm pretty sure. But they'll generally run up to you and then beg for food. Huh. Oh, this is my pet raccoon. You just pet him and he sends up a lot of hearts. The bridge is blocked so I can't get across yet, but eventually I'll be able to. And then going back out of the forest is down to the plaza section, which is really pretty. Here's Wimmy's restaurant. This is the main plaza. Oh, here's a friend. And you want some raspberries. Cutie. This takes you up to the um, castle. And let's see, this is my house. I just kind of rearranged the yard. Um, I didn't know if my raccoon would like a little house of his own, so I just put that in today. This is my garden area where I can plant vegetables. And Mickey lives across the way from me. This is Mickey's house. Mickey Mouse. And down in this area, I brought Wally in. This is Wally's garden, and he's working on it. I don't know where Wally is. Oh, here's Wally's house. I put it pretty close to his garden. But his house looks like it does in the movie. And Wally is so adorable. 
He's really happy. He has his little boot with the plant. He shows it to you, among other things. This game is so much fun. I've been playing like nonstop. Oh, you are too cute. Just like in real life. Feed the squirrels. Play feed the raccoons. And they have bunnies that you can make friends with. They eat the carrots. I have a couple of bunny friends. I think you can make them companions, but I really like the little raccoon guys so far. So what else can I show you? Oh, I had opened this section yesterday. It's the woods again. And you can get coffee beans off the tree. And there's a witch that lives up in... Ooh, that's a new little guy. I've got to play tonight because I need to see all the night creatures. That was the little frog. Oh, here's the octopus lady. I've no sunshine. You're here, finally. Ursula. Sorry, I can't talk Why right are now. you still here? You. So this is the big tree house, and there's a witch that lives in here. Her name's... Um, I think her name's Mother Somebody. We'll see if she's out. We can run into her. And I'm starting to lose the light, so I think I'll get out of here. But this is a wood section again where you can pick up mushrooms. And there's a lemon tree. You can pick the fruit off of it. It's totally like Animal Crossing, only I really love the looks of this game. This is where Merlin lives. It's his library. I, kind of, I have to straighten up his yard and stuff. There's Mickey. He's living here. And there's Merlin up above. There's Remy. You can go shopping in this store. Remy has his restaurant, and I put Remy's house right here. It's fairly large. Uh, that's Remy's place, right across the street from his restaurant. Because he's got such little feet, I hate to see him have to go very far. But all the flower beds, trees, you just, you don't have to pay for the trees or the palm trees or anything like that. You just pull them out of the menu, put them up wherever you feel like you want to put one. Uh, Mickey asked me to build a birdhouse, so I'm hoping we get some birds. I built a bird feeder today. Here it is by the little birdhouse. And your character, you can change their clothes. This is a more garden area where I have to plant some stuff tonight. And everything, oh, this little squirrel's my friend too. It's a little brown squirrel. And I have kind of streamed out a little Never bit of my house. Your imagination is a powerful magic. They have the same mailbox system and So this is like my front room. I brought I bought this enchanted room. I was hoping that it would interact with you and move around the house. I'll have to see. I don't know how to change the color of things, that's why the 
furniture is all white. This is my bedroom. I'm going with the sun, moon, and star motif. But I really don't have to have any choices for furniture yet. You can store stuff in chests. This is where I put my, um, all my precious stones that when I collect a bunch of them, I turn around and sell them to Goofy and he gives me money so I can go buy things. This is the start of the kitchen. And I wish I knew more about how the game worked, but you could, I sized these rooms out um, not really well, but oh well, live and learn. I need like a table or something. You can make clay pots and put different flowers in them. Purchase, this was purchased from the store, I think. Some of the animals give you gifts. And you can change your outfit. So, your pocket space isn't huge, but Since I'm going to be running around tonight, um, and I have, do not have ring clothes. So normally what uh, I've been wearing, I'm going to get out of these flip-flops. And I also got a surfboard that I can um, light on. It's pretty cool. Here. There's my surfboard. And what else do I need? Oh. The, my hairdo usually is No, it's not that. It's look. I look like that. Um, and I was going to put gray hair because I'm older, but what the heck? So this is me. And my name's Emily. And that's the end of this video. And I'm going to. Occasionally post what I've been doing on Dreamlight Valley.